with one set of lights and it just went further and further and further. And it was about 12 years ago I decided to do it for charity because people were knocking on my door every night. I'd like to give you some money for charity. So we don't do it. And in the end I said to my husband, well, Christmas is about kids. I said, and somebody might as well make money out of it. I said, why don't we do Claire House up the road? I said, some of them won't see next Christmas. I said, so let's do it for them. Went up to Claire House the next day, explained. He said, oh yeah, we'd love you to do it. And ever since, and now I've raised nearly £25,000. We only have weekends but normally if you'd had a week off you, you could do it in a week but that's all day you know from being out from about 8 o'clock in the morning till about 5 o'clock um, but yeah and I also don't just put mine up I put my neighbours up as well because they can't go on the ladder so we do theirs as well for them this canopy we normally put up at the end of um, I have this canopy over my drive for the grotto and we normally put that up on the end of um, August. That's when we start the August bank holiday for that. And then we start here about October. And the switch on is always busy like this. And then every single night from quarter past four when the lights go on, it's constant all night long. I have a red post box in there. All the kids put a letter in there to Santa with the name and address on. I hand write them all the letter back in the post. All them stamps, all the envelopes, all the letters, all come out of my own pocket. Santa comes every single night, six o'clock, every night. I give up the whole of my December for this. I will not go out because uh, normally I'm out here all night long talking to people. And I've seen kids coming when they were like that and they're now bringing their kids. And also when Santa comes out every night, we give out sweets to kids every single night. So all that comes out of our park. Plus the cost of the electric. And people's first, that's the first thing everyone says, oh, your lucky bill must be sky high. And a few years ago, we went on a smart meter and he took a reading the night they went on, just as we switched on, and it worked out about £60 on top of my normal bill. That was about four or five years ago. It's probably about £100 now, but £100 nothing.